one continues with Resident Evil 8, The Mercenaries. Now this is me right after I finished the story mode, and my god, that game was incredible. I cannot wait to unlock as many things as I possibly can, but for right now, we are going to continue playing with The Mercenaries. I remember something just like this being in Resident Evil 4, and some other kind of crap happening elsewhere. Stand so let's by. see what this looks like. It'll probably be a shorter video, so I might upload this, um... I might upload this the same day as... Cool. I might upload this the same day as... Um... Sorry, I blanked as out. You wish. That much stuff. Um... Let me... Pay me no mind. Gunsmith. I only have that much money. But let's see what else I can get. I can get the M1911. Which is... Hopefully I have a handgun. I think I might actually need that. So let's go ahead and sell the Lemmy. This should be enough. Pay me no mind. And we're gonna buy the M1911. One of these. <laughs> and just in case, let's get one of those. Thank you for your patronage. And I'm not gonna worry about organizing because I don't know what this game's all about. Uh, mercenary rank. Oh wow. Okay. Prep room. Start. Um. shows me a readout for Oh, this is so so cool. Assassination death. Movement speed increases when knife is equipped. No brainer. Headshots do more damage. Pistol master. Handguns do more damage. Oh, this is nice. This is fun. Combat attacks do more damage, long distance attacks do more damage, headshots do more damage. So the handgun does damage these guys. Did I... 
to first purchase any equipment or weapons you need from the shop. Then, when you go out into the field, you need to defeat as many enemies as possible within the time limit to get a good rhythm going and build up the combos for extra points. Once you've defeated a certain number of enemies, the goal will appear. Touch the goal to finish and do move to the next area. Complete more areas and rank up and blah, 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 orb, 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 orb. Welcome, Ethan. To... I'm skilled at all sorts of weapons modifications, and will do them for a small fee. These hands are more dexterous than one might think. That's great, dude. Why don't you tell somebody about it? Thank you for your patronage! Alright, here we go. Is it going to start me off in the same area again, or are we moving on to... Arr. No! This is my jam, this is my jam, this is my jam, this is my jam. Choose an ability. Let's do... Oh, I'm replacing things. Fine. so I can get your shit. Hold the phone. Here's my phone. Initial attack does more damage, but the HP is full. <sighs> I'm in the goal. Oh, there you are. Where? Oh, there you are. Great. 
Damn it! Clear. Shit. Oh, that's nice. Still don't have a shotgun. Welcome, Ethan. Um, can't afford that yet. Um, I can get this shotgun, but it'd be better to save up for that shotgun. Um, um I don't really need this yet. As always, a trustworthy, Nuts. fair exchange. I will use that later. How much can I get? That's a lot of death, though. So this. Your coin. Securing goods is Get more important this. than anything. Anything, my friend. Okay. A good deal, if I say so. Yeah, that's great. Shut up. Start. Anything in this area? Speed, super guard, HP recover slightly when attacking with a gun. Hmm? <laughs> Not good for the situation. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> Where's the money? Oh, hello! You fuck, you were dead! Shooter. <laughs> Attack increases when switching between enemies. Attack increases, but speed decreases. Shotgun, shotguns do more damage.
out of reach, long distance attacks do more damage. Blade Master max HP increases. Blade Master, uh, that's this one. There's this one. kind of interesting what if mercenaries turns out to be the vr simulator that's um mia winter uh rosemary winter's training that would be pretty fun ha chief b rank in the village lee at the start of the stage stage the castle Ooh la la hang on one second okay i'm back i had to quickly help my mom with something uh she wanted to measure how tall I was in relation to a fence. And I stood next to the fence. Ah. I said, I'm <laughs> six foot. I'm six foot exactly. And then she says, no, I want to measure you and the fence. And I'm standing right next to the fence, which is the exact same size as me. And she's like, no. I want to measure, it's like, dude, I fucking get it, but the thing is, is you're not seeing it. The fucking obvious thing here is, Start. I am six foot. The fence is six foot. Maybe off by like a fraction of an inch. But like, why do you need to measure me and the fence when we are the same fucking size? It's like, I'm six foot. And she's like, your sarcasm isn't appreciated. I'm like, it's not sarcasm. I'm telling you the answer that you're looking for, but you just won't fucking listen. It was like one of those things. They took away my good gun. Oh my god. What the fuck am I supposed to do with this? <laughs> um... Ah! Yeah, okay. So I don't keep my bullets. likely explode when they're defeated with a gun. That's gonna be good. Recover a little issue when the enemy is defeated. Okay. Let's do this one. And that is gonna make this very situational. He 
He's not gonna explode. Come on, boy. Come on. Fucking try! Considering I fucking thought that I was gonna start this with my original guns, I think I'm doing pretty fucking sweet. If somebody told me at the fucking beginning that I needed to freaking damn it I buy a fucking gun. Alright, I'm going to play this in my downtime. This is just really fun. I can't believe how much fucking effort went into this. feels... So back in the day when GameCube and PlayStation 2 was a thing, you really felt like they put as much effort into games as humanly possible to make it... As good as humanly possible. The games were big. They were grand. They were fun. They had unlockables. They had secrets. And they even showed concept art. And really cool shit like that. I'm so fucking happy to finally get a game. Where it brings that joy back. After years and years. Of just shit. Where they just didn't fucking give a crap. Like, that's the reason why I like Dark Souls so much. Lots of unlockables, lots of lore, and when you look up online, you can find the art, and I have yet to find any making of videos, which really kicks my ass. But the fact that it's all included in the game itself, I love it. This game is phenomenal. There's a lot to enjoy with this game. I highly suggest it. I got this thing on sale. I bought it for $29. Holy shit, is that a bargain. My god, man. If you guys aren't playing Resident Evil Village and you're a fan of the Resident Evil series, you are shitheads. Play this game. Enjoy it. It's fun. It's magical. And there's a lot to love in it. Enjoy yourselves. Have a great day. Please leave a like and a comment. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'm going to go stand next to a bunch of wood and measure myself. Bye-bye.